Okay, so now I want uh, 25 of these guys. So we're going to need a set of filters. Let's get some of you. We'll get half stack of those guys. And there we go. So for 25, we're going to need 50 of these thomium plates. We clearly don't have that. So let's go ahead and ask for 50. And we'll see how far we get. We can get 7 right now. I don't know how much more essentia we're going to need. I'll probably have to get some more salus. And to get more salus, we're going to have to... Uh, get some crystals so let's see what we have over there we've got a bit of precantatio in here uh, let's see here I want some files let's take you and let's dump you over here And we'll take this guy and dump him somewhere too. So we may be full on Perdicio. Nope, he's empty actually. Okay. All right. I mean, we're doing pretty well actually, I think. So let's go back and see how it's doing. I think we may have enough of this. They only need five apiece. So to do 50, it shouldn't be more than a full jar, I think. Math is only occasionally my strong suit. All right, more thomium plates. So let's get some of those guys. Oh, yeah, we're already there. Okay, 8, 9, 10. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Ah, out of V. You have to wait a little while for it to get back up there. Not sure what it's complaining about right now. Looks like it might be a little bit... Oh, we're out of air crystals. Huh. I guess there was a graphical glitch showing uh, how many it had. Maybe I read it wrong. I don't know. I think it was a gravel glitch. But let's get some more air crystals. So to do that, we'll go over to Thawncraft area. And we will get some quartz slivers. Let's get a stack of you. So uh, what I want to do is... Put these guys in here and then I will make air crystals there we go we'll get plenty of those guys in there now and then we'll come turn off that recipe later on so there we go plenty of air crystals maybe we'll see all right go back to the house and let's get more air crystals in there. And now let's get recipes for this guy again. All right, so there's 19. Ah, it's Terra this time. Okay. Okay, that's fine as well. I'm not sure how well we'd be able to do this. Um, you know, we need it to make, uh, to keep a stack of those on hand all times, I think. Let's get some of those slivers. And let's make sure we always have a stack. All right, let's get uh, you in here. 
Okay. Oh, I changed this guy. I realized the limiting factor to getting blaze rods is having enough uh, blaze power in the system. So if I only if I always keep enough, uh, if I always keep five stacks of blaze powder, I can always make a stack of blaze rods to export from here. So uh, I haven't done that yet, but let's see here. Where are we at on blaze powder? We've got 91. So I thought I made more blaze rods than that. Maybe I used them. I probably used them. So at some point, I should be able to get more, a full stack, and keep it in here. In fact, if I just go ahead and set that, it probably won't try to craft those right now, but as soon as it has enough blaze powder to get what it needs, it should craft that. And it will eventually have that, just that, you know, this thing takes forever. Uh, you know what? Let's, uh, let's accelerate him. So, how will that work? That's going to kill the power. Alright, fine. It will eventually, you know, go back to what it was doing. But. Alright, so let's go back to Thomcraft. I've got more quartz slivers now. So we need to go over to the Thomcraft area. Oh, here you are. And let's get the quartz slivers. Okay, so we can just take that recipe off, put this one in here, and we can go for, I think it's alphabetical, so it should be way down here. There we go, Terra. All right, there we go. Now we'll have enough of those guys. Or we'll have to make more. I don't know. We'll see. Okay, so Terra Crystals. Alright, yeah, we've got enough to make 20 now. 21, 22. Yes, yeah, it's, it's not decreasing the number over here. 3, 24, 25. So it really has only 10 in there. Okay. It's okay though. We're done now. So what do we have as far as tubes go? Yeah, I've got plenty of tubes. We need some jars. So let's get some of you. Uh, we need more panes for that. Yeah. Why am I not keeping them in stock too? Crafting things on demand? That's no fun. Well, it is, but, you know. There's no reason to do it. At some point. All right, so let's keep a stack of you in there too. There we go, we should always have panes of glass now. All right, back to the Thomcraft area. All right, so let's make those warded jars. I need five, three, four, five, there we go. Yeah, that looks right. So, Essentia, we have a lot of Perdicio, so we'll probably use that for this guy right now. Alright, go to Thomcraft Basement, and set this guy up somewhere. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, yeah. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so here's the middle jar. And get the flux condenser and get the pipes. And put the lattice pieces on top. Go two out from each side. The internet told me this was the best design, so it must be true. There are never any lies on the internet. Everything you read there is 100% true. And don't bother checking the sources. Waste of time. Internet will never lie to you. They are good people on the internet. Good, good people. Alright, let's dump Essentia in here. 
And then we can clean up the flux that will be generated in this chunk from those stabilizers. And this is pretty much the reason that I wanted um, two rooms and two chunks for this stuff. I wanted to make sure we could always clean up the flux in the various areas. Alright, I think I put uh, this stuff in here too. Wow, you are empty, aren't you? Okay, let's get some more sent you. Looks like you've got the most of this guy and then Metallum. So we'll use that. Half of you will be Terra and half of you will be Metallum. But you're always going to get some unwanted Essentia when you're doing, you know, Essentia smelting. So, you know, just put it in here and, and that's what you do with it. That's why I made tons of extra jars over the top. I didn't want to lose any Essentia. Alright, so they're good. So where's my thermometer? I want to check out the flux in the area. 30 over here, not bad. And 46 over here. Not bad. Okay, where are some files? You've got 5 and you've got 103. And then, you know, that Vicium can be broken down again into more Perdicio. So, it's a good cycle. And you get Precontashio, which is much more useful. So. Alright. Uncheck that guy. Yeah. I think we're doing pretty good. Alright, yeah. I'd say we're doing great over here. Alright, so next thing I want to look into is Essentia Mirrors. I want to put Essentia Mirror down on the floor to draw Essentia from over here and then let it be drawn over here to the Runic Matrix. So let's look into that. Thalmanomicon should be Infusion. Maybe not. Maybe it's Artifice? It's Artifice. Okay. So I need Mirror Magic. We have to get Mirrored Glass and Ender Pearl. So, Mirrored Glass. That's Arcane Infusion. Okay. Uh, let's go back over to the house then. And take a nap, because naps are great. Alright. So, we need some mirrored glass. There we go, mirrored glass. And an ender pearl. There we go, got an ender pearl. So, let's go ahead and open this up. Alright, uh... Magic mirrors are nice. I probably won't use them because I don't need them for what I'm doing, but, you know, they're nice. I want Essentia mirrors, though. The theory and artifice. All right. Let's see. Artifice theories are arcane workbench, I think. Okay, we need one of these guys or a dropper. Well, I can get a dropper much easier. Let's get a dropper. There we go, dropper guy. Okay, we need uh, either Aversio and Volatus. We don't have anything for Arcane, so we might as well do Aversio and Volatus. Um, Aversio and Volatus. Okay, we can tinker if we had a thermometer. It's not going to break it, so I should be able to do that right now. We can calibrate or do universal theory. I want calibrate for artifice. Can concentrate or get uh, Lux Essentia. Let's do the Permutatio Crystal. Alright, let's see here. Definitely don't want to reject. Don't really want universal theory either. I guess I'll get some clay and do Golomancy. All right, there we go. Piece of clay. Okay, let's see here. Uh, ponder will work. Uh, here we go. A daylight. Let's make that. Oh, we could ponder. 
Let's do uh, this one. Let's pick an AI sensor. So you need this stuff. There we go. There's one of those guys. Can't scan? Maybe I already have. All right, the uh, daylight sensor. Can tinker with an ender chest, a vanilla one. Let's get one of those guys. And one of these guys. There we go, we'll tinker with that. Okay, um... Ah, Solar and Waning Gibbous. Let's get that. Solar, I have. Waning Gibbous. There we go. Alright, so... I guess we will do Ponder. And there we go. And Artifice Theory. Cool. Cool. So now I should be able to get this guy. Okay, making these guys, we need to do two infusions. Uh, we need iron and ender pearls with mirrored glass. We need aqua, modus, and permutatio. That looks like it ought to be pretty easy to get. So let's get uh, two of those mirrored glass guys. No quicksilver, huh? Okay. This is why I always kept a stack of this stuff in here. So let's take a let's take half a stack of you and chuck you into the furnace. Actually, what's the best way to get you? I think first is the only way to go, really. But is there a better way? Flux as would give you two. Yeah, not worth it. All right, there we go. Get some more get some more quicksilver. So again, I want a mirrored glass. I want two of those guys, and we're gonna need iron and ender pearls. Got both those things for days, so yeah, almost four thousand ender pearls now. All right, so going back to the Thomcraft area. It wanted Permutatio, which is not Fabrico. It wanted Modus, and it wanted something else. Uh, let's see here. It wanted Aqua. Okay, Modus, Aqua, Permutatio. Let's go grab the Aqua. And this should be the last time I have to grab these jars over here. All right, so mirrored glass, three iron and ender pearl. Careful when you right click ender pearls. One, two, three. Where's my gauntlet? Here we go. It's a miner, and we've got stabilizers, so this realistically should remain at very stable. It should not change a bit. These stabilizers are going to pretty much. Maybe not prevent, I, have, I haven't tried lots of really high instability recipes, but you add these guys and your stability just, it's really good. So, all right, there we go. One mirror, one, two, three. Okay, so we're going to stick this mirror over here in the center of these guys. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, I think. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's an eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Close enough. And then we'll take the other one. And we need to link him, so we'll right click to link him. And now we're going to put him on the wall. Right here. And then whenever the altar needs Essentia, they can draw it through the mirror right into here. 
So let's see here. You are Permutatio. And then there's Aqua, which goes over here. And finally, Modus, which goes here. So now I should no longer have to worry about where my attention comes from. I don't think this guy, this guy might be able to reach like, you know, the close, the near, the nearby ones, but the far ones, I'm not 100% sure he would be able to reach them, but I'm pretty sure he would not be able to. So we don't want that to happen. Um, you know, if I wanted to, I could separate these rooms more, but you know, it's fine where it is. I'm, I'm not worried about that. All right, that's a good wrapping up point for today's episode. Thanks for watching. And as you can see by the text on the left, I actually will at some point build that gas farm. So hey, keep watching. See you next time.